Hey guys, new types. Welcome back to Forbidden Gundam Reborn. Forbidden Gundam Reborn. <laughs> and Death Scythe Reborn. And yeah, uh, we're doing a Gundam Unicorns story mode. We're here with Anna Volgado and Banana Bread in the Death Scythe. Banana Bread. <laughs> I can uh, go for some Banana Bread right now. Banana Bread. Or maybe some ice cream, because apparently everyone in Unicorn likes ice cream. Oh god, please. It was that one statement of that fucking jerk. Yeah, do you movie. know like how fragile I am with anime? It's like that one fucking joke. Like I'll just like beat it beat the dead horse of it. <laughs> like what series is the what series is um Bright Burger? Bright Burger? Wait, yeah. Bright you, you know that image of Oh you mean Bright eating the hamburger? Yeah. Oh, that was a well that originally came from a double zeta. Oh, okay. Yeah, and he's just scarfing down burgers. And then everyone turned into a sick fucking joke with Bernie. Yeah, there's nothing left but a bunch of, like, you know, it's just hamburger. <laughs> and that's why people... No, yeah, yeah, that's the, the meme. Yeah, yeah, The whole thing with, yeah, the hamburger meat. Oh, man. Yeah, no, I, I'm surprised how many Gundam memes there are. Like, I didn't realize, like, the community for memes for Gundam. That one that I saw, the, the, the one with J.K. Rowling. Oh, that one. J.K. Rowling. Yeah. It's so hard killing characters. And then it shows Tomino's in the next panel. You must be new to writing. <laughs> you must be new to this. <laughs> I love the. Oh my god. There's that one video. That well, who showed who showed us that the Amro eating a sandwich while on. Dude, Zakumiki six is that thing killed. <laughs> so we put the time in to make it. It was so funny. It's basically a video. It's a loop of Amro uh, from the. It's just the original Gundam when he was eating the, the sandwich when he was just. Uh, yeah, that's that, that's basically just set to very odd music. <laughs> Queen Queen now likes that bright slap like a lot. Oh, the bright slap? <laughs> yeah, he's like, I want to get to that. <laughs> let, 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 guys, let me know when you're doing bright slap because I will be all for that. <laughs> yeah, bright. He uh, bright really. He tries to slap everyone as much as possible. Yeah, no, it's good. Please bring the stern formula back to government. Yeah, we, really. We need to like. Get these kids under control because some fucking things in Gundam Universe are just like. Oh god. Oh, and you know what I wanted to say to uh, to everyone watch all new types? Would you guys, if you had the chance of seeing uh, Gundam uh, in G or you know Gundam Recon Gisa, uh that's the new Gundam mm. that just started, and um, Tomino has what they showed in the first episode. It's basically in Universal Century, just right. way after Universal Century is over. Right. And, uh, yeah, no, I know what you guys thought of it. I actually, I liked it. Almost like Miyazaki actually directed it. And the art style is actually... Is it the art? Like, is it... Mm -hmm. oh, no, 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 no. It, it just started. It just started in Japan. The, uh, the first two episodes came out. The third one, I mean, probably when this comes out, it'll probably be out. But, um... I actually, I mean, I like it. It's a, it's a no. Nice I, I didn't know if it was one of those things where it's like, all right, they're finally starting to dub it. Right. No, right. no. This, no, this is, like this that. is, yeah. People are sub. It's getting subtitled and everything. But um, I honestly, I don't mind it. Um, oh, did you want to talk about the the sunrise partnership? Oh yeah, yeah. Hey, we've been post we post that on our on our Twitter. Uh, for those of you, I mean, like I says, it's probably later. You guys might already know, but. Uh, yeah, Sunrise and the right stuff that the anime distribution um, website um, they came out with saying how we're they're going to release or re-release all the Gundams again, starting with 0079 and Turn to Gundam. Yeah, that's incredible. for the very first time in America. Is getting a D these are all DVD releases like boxes you'll be able to get. It's going to start this spring, 2015. Um, yeah, that's, and, a, that's and, absolutely incredible. Yeah, and and, and they they updated uh, all hype for Gundam Origin, which is oh Gundam Origin, lives. <laughs> oh, yeah, or Gundam Origin is going to have. They're also going to come out with a DVD release, uh, and it's going to have English dub as well. Wow. Um, and we're also going to be getting uh, Double Zeta for the very first time in America is going to have a DVD release. So, I mean, that's yeah, it's really it's really awesome. They they're finally do someone finally got the rights for Gundam again. I mean, it's about goddamn time. You know what I. Love? Mm. If they just like pull the whole like <clears throat> they pull the whole like DBZ battle of the gods. Yeah, we're gonna do origin of theaters. <laughs> I would die with that. Yeah. I mean I've oh my god. That would be that would be so good. Like can you imagine the screening Gundam like in theaters in America? I know. Any that would that have been great. That would have been really, really great. 
and give people the opportunity to check it out. Seeing the seeing the things on the big screen is always is always nice. You know, you talk about your dreams. You know, you keep talking about your dreams; they're bound to happen. You know, it's for you. Just uh, just you know, a few uh, something odd years back. You know, dynasty orders and guns. Gun? Uh, yeah, I know. Well, my other dream that I always that I always talk about is I need Cody to make me a Dragon Ball Warriors game. <laughs> So, Koei, uh... <laughs> a week later, when this episode airs, yeah. Uh, so, we, so we saw your thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we saw your thoughts, and uh, really, uh, really liking what you had to say about that. I would love, uh, on this channel, there was, like, a Bonnet Darko spy. Just, like, someone subscribed. All right, all right, they want, they want, they want gun, they want, the, they want Dragon Ball Warriors. All right, get on that, get on that. <laughs> you fucking listening to us right now? <laughs> yeah. We want that shit. <laughs> <laughs> it would be great. It would be so great, and it would actually, unlike the, a lot of the Dragon Ball fighters, it would actually have the speed and everything you'd want out of it. Right. But we didn't read a lot of health right now. What the hell? Yeah, what? Oh. It's because she's uh, damaged. Okay, hold on. No, I want to see Okay, but I'll tor you'll just... torch my cockpit. That's kind of... That's kind of... It's kind of unnecessary, don't you think? I mean, yours is already torched. Oh, we're the Scythe Brothers. Oh, look at that. Yeah, yeah. Scythe 5. Yeah, all right. Yeah, my mind's metal. Because uh, that, that, that makes sense. Mine's a lightsaber. Yeah. Or fire, or whatever it is. Fire. Fire. Look, it looks like fire. fire. It's a beam saber. It's beam. <laughs> fire. Yeah, because fire's eyes. <laughs> it's lightsaber. This is Star Wars. <laughs> By the way, guys, uh, Star Wars Rebels on Disney is going to be starting their computerized Disney thing. Disney starting with a new Star Wars series, and boy, it Star looks... Wow, Star Wars right now is pissing me off. It looks awful. Yeah. It looks terrible. No, it'll never be, like, back when it was before. Mm-hmm. You know, so give up with Star Wars. It's going to be that overhyped, like, The Hobbit, like, non, you know, like, it's just not going to be good. Like, <laughs> No, it's really, it's really, I'm not, I'm, I'm not, it looked like Aladdin. Ooh. Like Star Wars and, Al yeah, Aladdin and Star Wars. Well, yeah, Disney would just do anything to, like, because, oh, God forbid they have to sacrifice the image of Disney. <laughs> right. Like, even, like, uh, yeah. Yo, my funnels aren't working. That's why, like, you know, like, all the new, I, I remember we talked about this, like, earlier, but all the new, like, Disney stuff coming out, it's like, what are they going to put in Kingdom Hearts? <laughs> oh, God. You know? Yeah, because they could do like you don't you don't understand how much they can do, and with all the new screen X bullshit, it's like Kingdom Hearts three might be the worst of the series. <laughs> I'm I'm gearing up for it. that's why I'm not so excited. I mean, yeah. it might it might be the worst. I mean, <laughs> look at look at those characters in fifteen. <laughs> Whoa, man! And people are so hyped. So uh, the unicorn now is all you know OP and everything. Yeah, where did this red come from? Cause he activated the NT system. Oh, I see. And um, what happened was he took control over Marita's funnels. Basically, the unicorn, uh, both unicorns, mm -hmm. are uh, they, they're able. They're basically they were designed to just uh, kill off uh, new types, so they're able to take control of other new type, you know, parts. But the, like uh, isn't Banner? Isn't anyway, I hope say you need to say Bananager. Uh, <laughs> Banager <laughs> isn't. <laughs> You've been saying his name for like the oh, past two bread. episodes. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, so Benager, all right. yeah. isn't Venager like a new type himself? He is, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's okay, he's piloting it. The suit was simply designed to verse other new types. Oh, okay. Mm. Alright. So I, I didn't know it was some kind of like mass genocide thing like caused by his own people. It's like oh, really so fucked up. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> no, that was if Tomino did Gundam Unicorn, but Tomino didn't do Unicorn. Which so I would love to who see. Did who's the team who did Unicorn, though? It's uh, some person who wrote a novel. Uh, wrote a few novels oh. for you. Know, that, that's who it was. That's how other Gundam uh, series are. Um, Tamino, you know, Tamino did Zeta. Mm -hmm. And he did, you know, the original Gundam. He did Double Zeta. He did Char's Counterattack. I mean, he basically, he wrote the fruit of all of it. Oh, Zinnerman. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I always home. pronounce it Zimmerman. Well, yeah, because you have that whole, like, trial stuck in your head. Oh, I can't get over it. I can't believe he's still fucking alive. Like, what is wrong with this world? <laughs> I'm really. Shar should have been on that trial. Excuse me, what? Excuse me, what? <laughs> We're done? That's it? It's imagine over. him. Yeah, imagine him freaking out. <laughs> what? What happened? Oh, yeah, I know. What? <laughs> but even so. That was. Oh, don't get me started on that. that <laughs> That's is... why I skipped through it, because I knew you were going to say something. That's the cop out in Unicorn. Look, 
At the end, Full Frontal's talking about this whole beautiful thing about how history is going to constantly repeat. He goes on this five minute rant, and Benazir just says, yeah, but even so. That's his argument! He says nothing else! He says nothing else! But even so. What's that mean? <laughs> you make sense, so I'm gonna say that to sound deep and profound. Yeah, but even so. Oh, so we're gonna deal with bullshit and not try and change the world? Alright, Benazir. Sounds good, but even so. Yeah, you have a complaint? <laughs> Yo, uh, shit. <laughs> Next time on Let's Survive. Impulse. We're going to be doing the ghost of the place. Oh, the place? <laughs> Alright, guys. Next for next time on Let's Survive New Types, the ghost of the place. La place. It's Laplace. <laughs>